Thanks for checking out this video. Today we'll be finishing up the status bar icons by covering the TB Layers feature. This command allows you to appoint certain default layers to the entities in your designs. This means that when activated, you won't have to manually switch between layers each time you change entity type, because they'll already be set to your preferred tiers. Simply select the TB Layers icon to activate the feature. Then right click to reveal a drop down menu and press settings to open the toolbox window. And you'll be presented with a list of draft sites entities and their default layers. By changing the layer name of any entity type and pressing OK, the new layer you choose will become the entity's default layer. For example, if you know you're going to add dimensions to your draft, you could change the dimension entity layer type's layer name to a layer called dimension. Then, every time you insert a new dimension into your drawing, it will automatically reside in that layer. In this sense, the TB Layers feature allows you to easily manipulate multiple layers, keeping your drawings organized and increasing productivity. So try it out for yourself to do more with your DraftSite experience. If you're looking to learn more, visit the blog page or visit DraftSite.com. Thank you.